all those rhymes, all these rumors, all those lies, all these so-called friends, and all those haters, I guess that's the price of fame, and I'm almost famous. All these beats, all those rhymes, all these rumors, all those lies, all these so-called friends, and all those haters, I guess that's the price of fame, and I'm almost famous. And you can say, I knew him when. <laughs> I knew him back, I knew when this guy was just starting out, just starting out, just starting out, just starting out. I'm out, I was out, you know, in the in the hood one to today, and I was like, you know, I'ma stop through and show my man Fendi some love over at Hood Locker, and they had Triller DVD out there, and then, then I, I got my interview in. Shout out to Van Nex, appreciate the love, homie. And you know, it was just me, Issa, and, and this whole bike crew. Yeah, you see it. Biker boy, golden child, DJ East Side or whatnot. Riding through, around town, nice lovely day and everything. Around the road, Greensboro, North Cat, little locker. Stopped through all the homie Fendi. Happened to see a bunch of Naps crew whips out the side, so had to stop through. Homegirl Sabrosa, she was out there putting it down and everything. My homie Van X, he was out there doing a major interview and everything for the Triller DVD. Big shout out to the homie Van X. My name is Jay White, I'm the CEO of Naps Entertainment. Um, right now we're working on a lot of projects. First we got the Nap School Entertainment uh, album coming out. Uh, DJ Issa is the official DJ for the Nap School. The name of, that, the, name of the, uh, the album is it's official. We got the Nap School movie coming out. What's it called? Trap Boom. Trap Boom will be already two videos deep into that. It's going to be something like Streets is watching. We, uh, remember Jay Z came out with Streets is watching. We did like seven, eight videos and, and had a whole plot to it. That's the same thing we're trying to bring it down here from North Carolina. contract with this club, one probably uh, do the most jump in this club in Greensboro called Jabs. So I came out to Jabs to check out my nigga E. Sud. He was DJing that night and to promote for our party that we had coming up the next week. My CD up and sold it to them niggas feeling uh -huh. me. We invested every dollar that that shit was getting me. Yeah. We beat up the streets until it made my haters sick of me. A hundred thousand units later, motherfucker, look at me. Big shout out to my dude Brandon D doing your one, two, three, thizzle. You dig what I'm saying? You know, you got Harlem behind you and all that. Wash Heist, Bloody Rock representing for the big homie and all that. You smell me? So, yes, like I can say right now, you know, I'm claiming that 730 dippy though. You smell me? We got to do a collabo, Brandon. You got to holler at me, man. Put that homie Zeke with you, B. You already know we gotta do a little one, two, three thing, man. The South meets the North. You smell me? That 8595, you dig? You already know. Let's get in the mess. Yes, sir. Yeah, anytime. All right, man. How about that? How about they out in the parking lot towing cars? So I'm like, yo, this is bugged and, out. And I hope my car don't get towed. It's, it's, it's the parking situation is like a little fight between two owners of two businesses, the owner of Jazz and the owner of this place called Great Outdoors, which Jazz owns half of their parking lot. And uh, in certain parts of the parking lot you can't park in. See all these cars going? They just got about 12, 13. Damn! Woo! That's why some mad people tonight. I got 12 motherfucking cars. That's cool. Wait a minute, I got 12 people. Hold on. 
everybody wanted to park everywhere. So the tow company came out and towed about 30 to 40 cars. I'm just glad they didn't get me. <laughs> It ain't just like one tow truck taking them a hundred blocks away and coming back an hour later. They had like four tow trucks taking them somewhere three minutes away. So they was that them doubling up, hitting everybody. Oh, look at that. Can't help but tell people, hey, don't park there, and they still park there. So they come out the club, and their cars be gone. It'd be so funny just to see their face. Right here. Um, what kind of car was it? A green Honda Civic. Just pulled out. Oh, and my purse is in there. Just pulled out. Pulled out what? <laughs> they just towed it. So how do I get my car? Because I, I, this whole row is getting towed. Why? Because it's not that parking, and then I mean, I get up here all night. Don't park there. Your car will be okay. towed. How much does it cost? Uh, $186. $186? Yeah. Oh. And there's the number to the place right there on the side of the building. Don't feel bad. They got about 20 some cars tonight. They should have had something up here that said When we parked here, there was nobody saying yeah, it. Says, I, there's no way I parked here and nobody ever It ain't no joke. You see the no parking sign, you better pay attention to it. They love to tow cars and they got on car towed a few times. Not there. Not another the clubs I've been DJing at because it's going to be a problem. It's coming straight out of the promoter's pocket or the club owner's pocket. Oh my God, I can't stop laughing. She's too cute. She's too cute. They coming out of the club drunk. Look, they so drunk that they think they unlock their car, open the door, sit down, fall on the concrete and say, where the hell is my car? This is where music meets hustle, you heard me? Been out all day grinding since fucking like nine o'clock this morning. It's two o'clock in the morning, the nigga Issa told me he wanted me to come to the club. Got right back to Greensboro, came straight to the club, support my nigga, and to get these people over here who just <laughs> got their vehicles taken. Oh, birthday, I'm 22. Come on, boo. Oh, 22, man. Right there. Come on, bro. Who what? I uh, Saturday. Saturday, I uh, 2006. Bro. I don't even know, bro. They might have got you. What's the little uh, little number for him, you know? Right there. That's dirty, though. These college kids, they don't have no dough, man. Y'all can't be taking their cars and charging them $186 to get their car out. Just put a big sign out that say, no parking. Not a little baby sign, a big sign. Pay for a billboard. That's the second time. Trying to back up, man. say I knew him when I knew him back I knew him when this guy was just starting out just starting out just starting out just starting out